Integrated Rate Law of a First Order Reaction Considered a first order reaction, N2O5 gaseous gives 2NO2 gaseous plus half O2 gaseous. The differential rate law of the reaction is minus DN2O5 upon DT is equal to KN2O5. If the concentration of N2O5 is expressed by C, then minus DC upon DT is equal to K into C, where K is the rate constant of the reaction. Therefore, minus DC upon C is equal to K into DT. If the initial concentration of the reactant is CO, the above equation will have the following limits for integration. C is equal to CO when T is equal zero and C is equal to C when T is equal to T. Therefore, minus integration CO to C DC upon C is equal to K integration zero to T DT. Therefore, minus ln C CO to C is equal to K into T zero to T. Therefore, minus ln C upon CO is equal to KT. Therefore, minus 2.303 into log C upon CO is equal to KT. Therefore, K is equal to 2.303 upon T into log CO upon C. If concentrations C of a reactant are measured at various values of time T, a plot of log C against T should be a straight line with a negative slope equal to minus K upon 2.303. This line should intercept the y-axis at a point where value of log C would be log CO. If the initial concentration of a reactant is expressed by A, and the decrease in the concentration after time t is b, then the above equation would take the form k is equal to 2.303 upon t into log of a upon a minus b. Since the ratio has no unit, it can be seen from equations 1 and equation 2 that the rate constant k of the first order reaction has a per time unit.